Hi guys, welcome to my channel. In this video, I'll be covering regular expressions and various functions that we use in regular expressions. Guys, I have uploaded complete Python programming subject tutorials. I'll provide link in description. You can watch from there. If you are watching this video for the first time, don't forget to like, share and subscribe to my channel. Let's get started. Regular expressions, shortly we call it as regex, is a special sequence of characters that uses search pattern to find a string or set of strings is known as regular expression. I will give an example so that you can clearly understand this definition. Let us consider this string. My name is Nagendra. Now I want to find whether RA is present at last or not. In order to check whether RA is present at last in the given string, just you need to apply pattern. Let us consider pattern like I want to find whether RA is present at last or not. So just write here RA and by using dollar sign, we can find last character. So I written here RA dollar. This dollar sign is used to identify last characters. Here I written RA dollar sign. So it will check whether RA is present at last or not. Yes, RA is present at last. So I will get output RA. This is my output. For example, if I write here ME dollar sign, then it will check whether ME is present at last or not. But last character is not ME, last character is RA. So you won't get any output. This is use of dollar sign. Regular expression is a special sequence of character that uses search pattern where this ME is special sequence of characters that uses a search pattern where this dollar is search pattern to find string or set of strings. By using this pattern, I am finding that whether ME is present at last or not. This is meaning of regular expression. These are various functions that we use in regular expressions. First one is match function. Second one is search function. Third one is find all. Fourth one is split and fifth one is sub, where sub stands for substitute. I will explain each of them by giving examples. This is example. Here at first I written import RE. Guys, just remember that where RE is package and it is also considered as module 2. So just I written here import RE and I written A equal to my name is Nagendra comma my age is 25 in double quotations. After that I am writing B equal to I am using match function. So just write here RE dot match. I am using here match function. So just write here B equal to RE dot match inside brackets write my because I want to find my I took here my comma this string is present in variable A. So just write here A and write print B. Match function is used to check whether given characters are available at first or not in a given string. Only if these characters are available at first, I will get output. In this text, I written my name is Nagendra Kama, my age is 25. And here I written re.match, inside match I written my. So match function will check whether my is available at first or not. Only if my is available at first in a given string, I will get output. Here I written my, so my is available at first. So I will get output my. I am storing this result in variable b. So whenever you write here print b, you will get output re dot match object span equal to 0 comma 2 comma match equal to my that means we found match that is my in index number 0 comma 2 where m is stored in index number 0 and y in index number 1 so here we will get output span equal to 0 comma 2 here actually i should get output 0 comma 1 but it will add plus 1 for last index so i will get output span equal to 0 comma 2 match equal to my that means we found match that is my in index number 0 comma 2 here i written my so only if my is available at first i will get output for example in place of my if i write here name so it will check whether name is available at first or not only if name is available at first i will get output here name is not available at first so here i will get output none if given characters are not available at first then it will display none for example if i write here only m it will check whether m is available at first or not yes m is available at first so here i will get output re dot match object span is equal to 0 comma 1 and match equal to m if you give here m this is use of match function. Next I will explain what is use of search function. This search function is same as match function but only difference is that where match function is used to identify whether given characters are available at first or not and whereas search function is used to identify characters that are located in any place in a given string. Not only first, if characters are available at any place, it will print those characters. This is use of search function. This is example. Just in place of re.match, I written here re.search. 
inside this i want to search name so i written here name so at first it will check whether name is available in given string yes name is available here this is my output that is re dot match object that means we found match object at index number 3 comma 7 where m is stored in index number 0 y in index number 1 space in index number 2 n in index number 3 e in 4 m in 5 and e in 6 i already said before for n index it will add plus 1 so I will get output span equal to 3 comma 7 comma match equal to name. That means we found match that is name in index number 3 comma 7. But there is one disadvantage in search function that is though if characters are available twice, it will display only once. For example, in place of name if I write here my, my is present here and next my is present here. Though characters are available twice, it will display only once and that too it will consider only first two characters so it will consider only this my and whenever you write here re dot search of my you will get output re dot match object span equal to 0 comma 2 so it will consider only first my it won't consider second my this is disadvantage of search function so in order to overcome this problem we use find all by using find all function we can overcome this problem so same example just i am writing here re dot find all just write here find all find all function will represent output in the form of list so you will get output in the form of list that is square brackets inside square brackets you will get output my see my is available twice so you will get output my twice this is output if you use find all function by using find all function you can find any characters that are available in my string for example here in place of my if i write here name so it will check whether name is available or not yes name is available here so it will print name all these are strings so you will get output in single quotations for example in place of name if i give here 25 s yes, 25 is available in this string so you will get output 25 and this 25 is not integer this 25 is also considered as string so you will get output 25 in single quotations this is use of find all function for example if i give here john john is not available in this string so whenever any characters that are not available in my string so just it will represent empty list whenever characters are not available in given string it will represent empty list next i will explain what is use of split function this is example of split same example which i took before here i written re dot split where split function is used to split given string for example here i written b equal to re dot split inside split i written nagendra whenever you write here re dot split of nagendra it will remove this nagendra and it will split this strings this result is present in variable b so whenever i write here print b i will get output even split function will represent output in the form of list so inside list it will print my name is this is one part and next so it will remove this nagendra and it will place comma in place of nagendra so comma and again comma my age is 25 is another part so whenever you write here re dot split so it will replace comma in place of nagendra and it will split this string as two parts one is my name is and next one is comma my age is 25 this is another part this is use of split function next i will explain what is use of sub function here sub stands for substitute substitute is nothing but replace for example if you want to replace any string then you can use sub function this is example same example which i took before guys definitely you need to import regular expression so it first write here import re and i took string that is a equal to my name is nagendra comma my age is 25 full stop i'm storing this string in variable a and next i took another variable that is b and i written b equal to re dot sub this is substitute function and now i want to replace this name nagendra with john so just write here nagendra when nagendra is string so you need to represent nagendra in double quotations comma i want to replace nagendra with john so write here john so take john in single or double quotations this string is present in variable a so definitely write here a or else it will display error so definitely write here john comma a and now this result is stored in variable b so whenever you write here print b you will get output it will represent output in the form of string so you will get output my name is john comma my age is 25 these are definitions of various functions first one is find all where find all returns a list containing all matches though if any string is available twice it will display those strings so find all function will return a list containing all matches and next one is search where search function returns a match object match object is nothing but any characters or string is considered as match object so search function returns a match object if there is match anywhere in the string and whereas match function returns a match object if there is a match starting in the string only if any string is available at starting 
match function will return that string and whereas if string is available at any location then search function will return that string this is difference between match and search and next one is split function split function returns a list as I said before, split function will display output in the form of list. So, split function return a list where the string has been split at each match. Next one is sub function where sub stands for substitute. If you want to replace any string, then you can use sub function. These are definitions of various functions.